Hi there Libra, welcome to this Just For You Just In Time reading where we look into what you need to know right now from Spirit. So let's jump straight in and pull you an Oracle card from the Moonology Oracle. We have got a Fiery Climax Approaches. Now it's the Full Moon and Aries card. So it feels like things are coming to um, a head here. They're coming to completion and there might be, you know, quite an intensity about that okay um being the full moon in aries it feels like there might be some action that you're needing to take or maybe one final action here the aries energy is associated with stepping up leading the charge taking control and sometimes taking a leap of faith as well let's see what we've got from oracle of the angels We have got the eternal light of love. So, you know, if there is an intensity about the situation, remember to bring love and compassion into the situation. Um, you know, see the situation from everybody's point of view here, but also know that you are eternally loved by spirit. And although you might be going through something that feels intense at the moment, spirit is always trying to guide and direct you to, you know, the outcome for your highest and best good. Let's jump in and pull some tarot cards, Libra some information about this four of pentacles okay look this is a situation where at the moment you're you're holding on okay now the four of pentacles can be um that we're holding on because there are you know fears of the uh, of the unknown right what lies beyond this situation there might be you know like financial dependency here you might be staying in a job because you know, there's worry about what will happen if you leave. You might be staying in a relationship because of financial dependency. You may be, you know, wondering, can I really um, play a bigger game? Can I get out there? Can I be more? Can I do better? While well, Spirit is saying, absolutely, yes, you can. And you are worthy and deserving. And it's really about you stepping into, you know, your energy of courage and confidence to, to move forward okay let's keep going the king of cups okay this situation could involve a scorpio okay it could be a boss or manager it could be a partner here um alternatively you are being asked to navigate through the situation as the king of cups which is somebody who is mature yet authoritarian is staying emotionally grounded even you know when emotions are getting high here right even when this fiery climax approaches but one thing that is clear with this combination because the king of cups is the um, scorpionic energy of of the death card right and it feels like the situation that maybe was once a source of comfort for you has now become maybe toxic for you or um, you've outgrown it. It's become like a skin that is too small for you and it's time to shed it. So it feels like it's time to release and that is what you are being encouraged as your primary message. In this reading, the Hierophant, yeah, Taurus energy, number five in the Major Arcana. So Spirit wants you to know that you are at an important point of change. Literally, the light may have gone out in this situation. The Hierophant is normally um, situations that are traditional and quite a, you know, a structured setting in our lives. This could be high commitment marriage, your work, career, place of study. Now, what has happened in this situation is that it feels like there has been um, either a value shift or you've outgrown it. It's just no longer a fit for you. And you might have even had an awakening to your truth here, Libra, and you're just realizing, look, this is no longer a fit. I can't really grow here. The only way for me to stay in this situation is actually to play smaller than what I am, to, to not share my voice or just to go along with things. And I think there's a feeling of powerlessness in the situation. So it really feels like it's time for you to go in your own direction. And the Hierophant is trying to say here, have faith, but realize you needed to experience a situation because it is the spiritual teacher that is sending you 
the, you know, into your power here, Libra, okay? It's the lesson for you to stand up and take action and really demand better for your life. Queen of Wands, we have Aries energy here. Again, you might be dealing with an Aries, but this is also the energy of taking that Aryan uh, action to manifest your new beginning. The Aries energy here of the Queen of Wands is the energy of determination to really get lit up again, to get energized again, to connect with your passion, your purpose, and your desires. So I feel like the flame has gone out of the situation for you, and there's been a certain amount of acceptance of, well, this is my lot, you know, I committed to this, I, you know, signed a contract up to be in this situation. But there has been an awakening that it's no longer going to serve you for the future and you are being encouraged. Your message for today is to take that action, okay? Consider releasing this situation before a fiery climax approaches or maybe it is that you're at that point and it really is time to move on. So that is your message here, Libra. I hope it resonated for you. It gave you some clarity, guidance, and insight. I am cheering you on and, of course, wishing you so much love and magic. Do take care. Bye for now.